make him impatient. Wait him out. The fight can be 10 minutes long. You're going to get him to the point where he gets so damn flustered, he's going to throw himself so out of position, and then you're going to jump in here and just wail the stuffing at him. <coughs> it, the, the one who is the master of this and can frustrate the living crap out of me is Jeremiah. Jeremiah will actually, he, he's the, he gets in my head doing this, irritates the heck out of me. We're just in range, and ju you know, I got him lined up, here comes the crosshairs, and he moves. And it's just... <laughs> and you know, we jockey for position, and I set up, and he moves. And then I finally just lose my shit, and I jump him, exactly, and he does what I did a couple of times. You know, I'm essentially going to wait. My opponent's going to do whatever they are. I'm just going to lean back and then pounce. When he throws that shot at me, instead of stepping out, when he throws the shot at me, I'm going to actually this and pounce. And one, two, three, four, except for Sylvester, I got all of you with that at least once today. It's just out in, pounce. But you've got to you got to control range. You have to... You guys have fought Greg. Gregor has range control bound down better than anyone has ever met in the FCA. You can fight Gregor, and Gre I have thrown shots at Gregor, and Gregor does this. And the shot misses his face. It's the most irritating thing on the planet. And he'll get in your head, and then instead of doing... You know, he'll do this, and just jump in your shorts, and pummel you senseless. So think about that when you're fighting. Where is my opponent's trigger? Are we to the point where, do I feel him growing roots like he's sitting at a Pell optimal range and he's sizing up that Pell to throw? And as soon as you see it coming, yeah. As soon as you see it coming, doesn't even have to be coming. As soon as he's ready and you can see him start to, oh, you know what, he's right at that range. Step out. As soon as you see step to the side. Mess it up. As soon as you see it, step to the other side. Yeah. Mess it. You can make Jan crazy at Wednesday practice. This makes Jan that He has these gargantuan targeting crosshairs that are slowly coming in like this. And you can see him getting his target lock pattern. And we get to about here you go. And they recycle back out to here. And you can see the five minute sequence come in. And then just is about to make it time when they get to here. You move again and fire and forget. Think about that. You've got to do that. Let's do one more round of singles like we've been doing, then we're going to step into minutes.